Hello, friends. Welcome to a new happy learning video. Today, we're going to learn what the units are: the tens and the hundreds. It's going to be so much fun. Do you know what a unit is? It's very easy. Each element is called a unit. It could be anything. For example, a toy, a tree, or an animal. The units are represented by single-digit numbers. One fish is equal to one unit. So, if we have two units, we represent them with the number two. Three units with the number three, and so on. Up until the number nine. Wow, so many fish! One more, and we will have ten. Ten units. Hmm. Do you see what happens with the number ten? We now have two digits: the one and the zero. We have a ten because ten units make a ten. <sighs> Remember, a ten. Is a grouping of ten units. Let's leave our fish tank here, because here come two more fish. If we count them all now, we'll have twelve units, twelve fish, or, in other words, a ten and an additional two units. I write it like this: the units in the first position, starting from the right, and the tens in the second position, always starting from the right. Now, imagine that the number of fish is increasing, and now you fill two fish tanks, and each tank has ten fish. We would have two lots of ten. The tens start from ten and go up in tens. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, and so on, up to the number ninety. One more ten, and we would have one hundred, one hundred units, one hundred fish. Oh, how wonderful! That would be equal to ten tens or a hundred. There are so many fish. I wish we could keep them all. The number a hundred has three digits. The hundreds are written in the third position, starting from the right. For example, let's write the number a hundred and thirty-five, which is equivalent to five units, three tens, and a one hundred. Let's try with some other numbers. Three hundred and sixty-seven. Now it's your turn. How many units do you think there are? Very good. There are seven units. The units are written in the first position, counting from the right. How many tens are there? Yes. Very good. There are six tens. The tens are written in the second position, counting from the right. And thirdly, how many hundreds do you see? Exactly three hundreds. The hundreds are written in the third position, counting from the right. Yay! Now you know what the units, tens, and hundreds are. You can practice with more numbers because units. Tens and hundreds are essential to be able to add and subtract, and it's a lot of fun too. By the way, should we release the fish into the river? Awesome! Now they can swim freely and in peace. Goodbye, friends. See you in the next video.